which is why I decided, I was thinking, like, what do I want to stream? You know what? Kerbo. Let's do a little Kerbo. I haven't done Kirby Superstar in a very long time. And this is one of my favorite rentals. Would you like for us to explain the game? No. Nope. Here's your tutorial. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Already a clown? Uh, listen, I've been a clown since day one. Vinny, you're too polite. What do you want me to say? You want me to, like, tell people that they're jerks? No, I mean, there are times I definitely wanted to, to uh, you know, flip out a little bit because people you know, say the same stuff, or they have bad suggestions, or whatever. Or maybe people that weren't at a previous stream asking me questions I've answered a hundred times. But I think probably like nine times out of ten, flipping out at the audience doesn't really get you anywhere. That one out of ten time. There's, there's that one time where it's good, but nine out of ten, it doesn't help. I mean, it's best to just kind of ignore it and move on and say, thank you for the suggestion, I appreciate that. I am in I am in fact a dumbass, thank you, that's correct. You know, you have to kind of know your own self-worth. Because you're not gonna get an accurate representation on the internet. You're either gonna get tremendous amounts of, like, ridiculous praise that is probably unwarranted and an overinflation of one's ego in the case of, um, internet personalities which is not healthy either, or you're gonna get the complete opposite of that, and you're gonna have people telling you that you are Satan. So, you have to be, uh, responsible for your own sense of self-worth, and you have to probably kind of figure that out sooner rather than later. Oh, get ready to watch a lot of helpers die. Y you're gonna see that a lot. What if you have zero self-worth? Um, don't stream or find some. <laughs> you know who's friends? Th these guys right here, Kirby and Mr. Chili. Wait, Mr. Chili's gonna die. Can you... Can you, like... Yeah, you can, you can, like, kind of... Oh, damn. Can you make out with them and give them a little health? Vinny, is this your favorite Kirby game? Hi, Joel. I don't know if this is my favorite Kirby game. It's close, though. I think this is my favorite as a kid. I have a, a lot of nostalgia for the first Dreamland on Game Boy, because that's the one I grew up with. Um... I really like Kirby Planet Robobot. Return to Dreamland is pretty great, too. But this one's got so much variety, you almost kind of... It's, it's an easy choice for favorite. Superstar Ultra? You know, I didn't, I didn't play Superstar Ultra, and now I kind of wish I did, because people are saying it was amazing. What's the extra content in Superstar Ultra? Like, new game modes? Meta Nightmare? Kirby 64 might have... Now that I think about it, Kirby 64 might be one of my favorites. Just because I love the weapon, uh, the, the skill combining system so much. Wow, that's really fucking broken! Anyway, thanks for watching. That's it. That's the whole game. Good night. Right here on Triple D, we're gonna go eat some fucking garbage. It is actually, this is kind of funny. This is kind of funny that diners, drive-ins, and dives, triple D, this is DDD, triple D. What happens in both things? They're shoveling, like, raw garbage into their mouths. It's very similar. They're pretty good. Who would you say is the best actor for each trilogy? Okay, Ian McDermott. Ian McDermott. And Ian McDermott. Ah, Hennekin. Good. Kill him. I shouldn't. It's not the Jedi way. Do it. I mean, the secrets aren't as meaningful in a game like this like they would be for uh, the later Kirby games, considering there's no, like, uh, collectibles per level that you all- you collect to make out with your helper. Um, that you collect to get a new level opened or whatever. It was cogs, and what was the other stuff? It was, like, cogs and cubes, stuff like that. And... Wait a minute, I did this level already. It... How do I get out of this level? Rewind? Yeah! Yeah. Yeah, just stand there and take the abuse, yeah. Ooh. Kirby's like, I just killed your mother. Wait, no, 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 he beat the shit out of their mother. 
Just to smack some sense into her. She's fine. She's alright. Let's see. They're good. Someone said, I wonder if Finn can finish the Great Cave Offensive. Nope. Why are there two Marios and Luigi's? Hey, assets ain't cheap, kids. The man runs a business. I swear on me, Jacob's helper. Do not ruin any future puzzles for me. So- Oh! Really? You gotta start from the beginning. Oh man, I forgot about that. Thoughts in mayonnaise and cereal. I'm banning you. I didn't ban them, chat. Don't worry. But... How dare- how dare you? Good. Anakin. Good. Ban him. I can't. It's, it's not the Jedi way. Do it! Second time tonight I've referenced that scene. I think I might be a little bit obsessed lately. I don't even like that fucking movie. That much. People like weird stuff. People put mayonnaise on a lot- Oh no! Treasure chest! People put mayonnaise on a lot of weird shit. I do like mayo on sandwiches. I- it's my go-to. Poppy. Seed. Bagel. Or... And now everybody- <laughs> Poppycock! Nunchucks. Is that- That's not how you spell that. I thought when Kirby was swimming up, that that was his butt. No, no, no. Look, it's not. It's not, but if- Oh, never mind. It's too late now. I thought that was the Kerbooty. I'm gonna idle on, um, Spring Breeze for a second to see the- I wanna see the cutscenes. You have to click it first? Oh! Uh, oh! This is what I made. You'll see me instigating console wars. This is just as the Wii came out. I made this. So I found this, so I, I apologize for the console wars, but I guess this is kind of just what was on the mind of everybody at the time. But, uh, yeah. So I, I made a fake magazine, and I even did articles, too. Who will win? But yeah, no, I, um... It doesn't look terrible, looking back on it. But I definitely, uh, could have done a little bit better. But I'll tell you what, I don't know where they are, but I did articles, too. I remember I did an article about GTA. I did, like, five pages. So you had to do a cover, and you had to do five articles. So I did this, and I did, um, Galaxy Preview, GTA Preview, I did a review. It was cool. Game Reactor is the name of a Swedish gaming magazine. Well, shit. Alright, so that was, that was one thing I found. And then I found something else. Uh, the reason I mentioned corn is because I found something that is highly disturbing, and... Well, the Game Reactor magazine cover, if I'm not mistaken, was early on in my graphic design class, and it was designed to kind of show what I could do. Like, you know, I was pretty good at Photoshop when I started the class. I I'd used it for a couple years already. And then by the end of the class of the semester, I think I just stopped giving a fuck because I submitted this. Um, you had to do a logo for, like, a, a company. And, um, so I found that. I just, you know, I found that in my folder of things from college. <clears throat> Thank you for watching, Kirby. Hope you enjoyed. It's good to be back. Maybe some of you would disagree after that previous thing. Please put something really stupid in the margin. I mean, this isn't really stupid, it's Kermit, but... Revenge of Meta Knight. I'll just do a new game. So we could just do a new game for each of these. And we could check out the cutscenes, too. Oh, <laughs> this is so cool. They should remake this again. They should call it... New Super Kirby Superstar Deluxe... Ultra. Kermit's face is just... I love Kermit's face. Oof. Jesus. Even with my invincibility, I'm still...
failing. S saved by the helper. Are you kidding me? Butt walrus. <laughs> I need to milk him. Shit. Oh no. Paint. I don't remember this. Okay. Well, that works. Well, I'm glad Suplex has that move. Oh my god. <laughs> I forgot how brutal this move is, uh, or this transformation. Kirby just likes to fuck things up. Who would win, Kirby versus Doomguy? That's why Doomguy needs to be in Smash. Alright, who would win? Kirby? But... Gollum has the ring up his ass. Alright, who would win? Still Kirby? Alright. Yes! I like how Kirby can sometimes be Babby Games, and then sometimes it's just not Babby Games. <laughs> I mean, if you've seen my Kirby streams, you've seen some of the extra modes. Like True Arena. Some of the more difficult game modes, and it's definitely not fully Babby. It's not like Dark Souls. It's not Zelda 2 or Castlevania or whatever, but... Since everyone uses Dark Souls, I figured I would too. Yes! Good, great! Oh, jump up there! Someone said you can infinite jump. Oh, you can, but you can't be... You can't be holding down the, the gas. Is that where the word ass came from? Because it rhymes with gas, which is a thing that is expelled from the rumpus? I wonder if John Ass decided one day. Man, that would be a great name for that thing. Donkeys? Well, why are donkeys like... like rump? But we won anyway. I don't know, I think tonight my brain is just not, like, available. Anyway, yeah, why are... why did donkeys become associated with bottoms? Jackasses? Because they're assholes. Ass does not equal arse. Because they're stinky. I give up. Use my touch screen here on my DS. Okay, we already saw that. Let's go to Spring Breeze. Since I already did Spring Breeze on um, the Super Nintendo version, before my save file mysteriously was fucking kidnapped by DDD. If Kirby can, like, inflate himself to that size at will, why not just do that and then roll into the castle and destroy it? Why sad Kermit? I don't know. I don't know. Why is sad Kermit? I don't know. The food that DDD stole is in the castle, and Kirby needs to drop it off. That's true. Okay, so aside from that, any other Kirby adventure, if Kirby can, like, inflate and grow to that big... I don't think it's fair that I have to play these fucking games not huge. Covers his eyes. Isn't that nice? Oh, cool, cool. What's next? Gourmet race? Cool. Almost, uh, almost ready for the- what's the next one? Great Cave. Let's- let's check that out real quick, and then we're ready. We'll be caught up. Don't mind me. Just got one more addition. Maybe I didn't finish just yet. Got one more. One more thing. <laughs> what am I the fuck am I doing? Alright, um, am I gonna play more of this now? Maybe a little bit more of this? 
kind of want to see Revenge of the King. King DDD wants revenge. Vinny, you know you skipped to the last stage, right? I do, I'm aware of that, yeah. I, 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 sorry. Gotta start a new game. <laughs> I just wanted to get the cigar. My brain, I thought maybe it was like an innovative form of storytelling. Where it starts at the end and then DDD takes revenge. I don't know. Enemies look weird. Are the Poppy Bros clowns? How many eggs do you think Kirby laid in a year? Says a chat member. Is it confirmed that Kirby lays eggs? No. We don't we don't know that. You don't know that. Anyone else enjoying that the cigar actually like goes over into the game? I'll do one more level, but first. Hang on a second. There's a 3D. Doesn't need a big one. I mean this is no vengeful meat, but it's Kermit's Pretty all right. I feel bad because now Kermit has been replaced. This is like, you know, like the death of Kermit's identity, and now it's just Kermit. But he's really fucking dapper. I'll give him that. Upgraded. Maybe they can both exist in the same universe. Maybe we don't have to choose between Kermit or Kermit. Or maybe this is Kermit's uh, Kermit's evolution or final form. There's, who knows? Who knows? I mean, there's there's just so much lore just waiting to be written. I'm pretty sure I unplugged that wretched orange-scented air wick, but my fucking nose is still filled with weird chemicals. Just call it cocaine like the rest of us. <laughs> there was um, something interesting I saw about... Oh, it was a picture of Macho Man, and it said that the test results came in, and there were trace amounts of blood in Macho Man's cocaine system. Vinny, you want to try to give him a wine glass? No! The hands aren't visible. There, there's no way I could get a wine glass in there. Have his toes poke out from the bottom. No! Stop! Stop giving me ideas! I don't need any more ideas. Hmm. Ooh, that's... that's a little frightening. Pretty good. Look at that. Look at this classy motherfucker. Kermit, how did you get so fucking classy? I just don't- I don't understand. Vinny, light his stogie. <laughs> Vinny, he needs legs. Okay. Alright, fine. One more thing. <laughs> oh no! I'm, so, I'm sorry to say this is not working. <laughs> this just is not working. I found a real, like... It's like a super crusty Kermit. Yeah, there's a third arm. It's all right, don't worry about it. Good enough. All right, I'm done. We are now. We're done. <laughs> there he is. Birth. No, there's no birth happening here, chat. Definitely not. Definitely not. Kermit will never really go away. No one's ever really gone. And now Kermit is gone. Or is he? He's not. Vinny, have you ever used a bidet? That's a pretty cool topic to bring up out of fucking nowhere. Um, how about... <laughs> have I used a bidon't? Slow and steady wins the race. Oh. This is ba Babby Cracko? Yeah, but Babby Cracko is fucking ridiculously hard. For- for me. Even in a Kirby game. Okay, not ridiculously hard. That- that's a bit much. Babby Cracko was... If you're not paying attention, slightly annoying. I think that's the best way to describe it. Looking real forward to DDD. Yep. Then you do the Anime King DDD voice? I don't know what that is. I don't know what it sounds like. D, 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 voice, anime, 
I need a monster to claw with that there Kirby. Like this is holy water. And that there's an order. Holy water? That there's an order. First, test him. Go, my servants. Uh, Great King, he, he had an easy time. Ah, we'll see how he likes the next. Why am I doing this? <laughs> Unthinkable. He beat that one too? Kirby's approaching here, your majesty. Curse, pig. Well, I can't believe it. Great King, pull yourself together. Well, Kirby's on his way in. What do you think about that, Dutch? Did you know that challenger pack number two is going to be six guys? Bandana D, no. I don't want to do this to Bandana. Kirby's a fucking bad person. Oof. You made it here. Now arm yourself. Oh, you can slide. Our grudge will be settled at last. Meet my powerful secret weapon. The brand new DDD Hammer. See, he's, he's at least very sportsmanlike. He tells Kirby to pick the thing up. He's not dead. He's in the background. Oh, yeah. No, he's good. Bandana D not dead confirmed. He's only a little dead. You fuck. You fuck. I know I'm taking little bits of damage, but I figure if I'm just careful with it, I won't... I won't actually, like, die. He says, as he's about to die. Is that Sakurai's voice? Kerber. Have you done? My castle. I can't feed my kingdom. My subjects will die. I will cry. And you will eat my house. Poor bastard. I mean, they're all wandering the desert. They have no food. They have no place to go. They're gonna, like, starve and drop off one by one. But at least Bandana D is alive for a little while longer. And, um, confirmed for character number 11. What do you think was in the burgers, Drib? I don't know, father. Let's do, um, Milky Way wishes. What do you think, chat? You wanna do some Milky Way wishes? Kirby card swipe? Let's try this. I don't know what the hell this is. Vinny, how'd you get a cursor on your DS? Okay, so now this Milky Way Wishes was in, um, original, OG Curb Superstar, so I like this one. Let's do it. But first, there's something we must do. Marx is- I- I- Marx is great. Oh, it's this thing. To ask Nova, we must gather power from all the stars around us. Which other game was this in? That I played? It will be difficult, Kirby, but you can do it. Robobot, right? That was the final boss in Robobot. We're counting on you. Good luck. I remember that was, um, there was like a bunch of different phases for that fight at the end. You could beat the shit out of water in this game? Yeah, I don't remember any of this. No, sir. It's called ice? I have to de I have to defeat the weird solid water again. I- 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 is... Was there anything else? Did I cover every topic that I wanted to cover? Did I leave anything out? Bidet? How about... no. No, I haven't used a bidet, God damn it. <laughs> Just before that happened, I read someone's chat message that said last room is going to be a treat. It was. Someone just said, all right, I'm gonna head out here, chief. <laughs> See you later. See you later. 
I've told you where I, um, record music. There's a lot of cats. There's a fucking ton of them. And it's, like, kind of by, a, like, a hill. Like, um, a slight hill. And I, I heard, like, what I thought was basically the, the omen or the exorcist, or both combined. And I was like, okay, something is dying and it sounds like an alien. And it was just a cat yeeting another cat off the fucking little hill. And the other cat landed just fine. But I'm like, wow, this must be like a tough life. If you're like, um, if you're a cat that doesn't like to fight. Because these other cats will just like fucking tear at you. No, 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 yeeting. Yeet, not eat. Yeet. Or they were fucking. Whatever was going on, I didn't like it. It was a really bad sound that I will never get out of my head. And then the weird thing is, the cat that got yeeted off the fucking hill, which again was like maybe 10 feet, um, landed and then screamed again and then immediately went to licking. Which of course, it looked like, and then it just walked away casually like nothing ever happened. It was like, yo, I'm alright. It sounded like bloody murder and then he was just like, yo, I'm alright. I'm alright, dog. This is- the brain- someone said in chat, the brain is so smooth right now. It's very smooth. It's not wrinkly at all. There's not a single wrinkle on my brain tonight. You know what this is? This is from waking up early. And then... fucking fixing a computer... for five hours, and driving back and forth to Micro Center three times. Twice, sorry, twice. But then to the other dude's place, and then back to Micro Center, the dude's place, Micro Center, it was, uh... That's- the, the brain... it has every right to be smooth. Sleep will be good. I feel like I might also be a little sick. I don't know if you can hear it, but I've been kind of stuffy. Like, I'm not- I don't feel like I have a cold. I just feel... a little- well, maybe a little- little cold. Anyway, now you've heard my excuses as to why I'm playing video games bad. Well, that's impressive. I managed to do this level without getting a single power-up. Uh, but yeah, I, I fucking, like, missed everything. Well, there's two. I can get... There's one I know how to get. But, yeah, I mean, it would be nice. It was on, um, other stuff. No, that's not where I have to go. Where am I going? Did I bean? Where's the bean? Hit the bomb block first. Where are we going, tree beard? Not good! Where am I going? Chat, I don't know where the fuck I'm going. Go up. Where up? Oh, up from the lava. Oh, yeah. Oh, Wing can do this. Yep. Yeah, touch every fire! Yeah, games, eat every fire! Vinny, did you know that the guy who directed Kirby 64 disappeared and nobody knows where he is? What? There are so many little tragedies, like for everything that seems kind of even a little bit innocent, and then you hear about this and you're like, oh, okay. Vinny, did you know that the guy who invented Kleenex was abducted by aliens, had his fucking organs removed, and then gave birth to an alien-human hybrid? All right, maybe that's stretching a little bit. I, I had to one-up the disappeared thing. Yes, chef! What are you?! An idiot sandwich, chef. I saw- I, th I don't know if I showed it on stream, but I saw a Gordon Ramsay cartoon where he fucking turns into, like, a six-armed, like, god at the end of it, and he's just chasing someone. Did I show that on stream at some point? Someone just linked me to the same song I'm listening to right now. And it was the exact same time. I think. I mean, I'd have to go back and check out the... the clip, but... Wake up! Yeah. yeah, here it is. I, I know some of you just want to watch Kirby and relax, but I, I'm sorry you have to see this. I think I showed this one, but I don't remember. If you haven't seen it, it's really worth Wake watching. Up. Yes, sir. Wake up! Yes, sir. Kill this finish to order, you lazy cow! Hurry up! Yes, sir. Fuck off! Watch my stuff, please. Get in there! What's wrong with you? <laughs> look at me, hey, look, you ignorant bitch. Look at my fucking eyes when I'm talking to you. Yes, What's wrong with you? I'm trying to work, chef. I'm trying yeah. to communicate. Wake up! <laughs> yes, the symbol dude in What's the background. Nothing. Yeah. Get a grip! Yeah. 
Hey, hello, come here, donkeys. Here we go. Come here. What is that? It's all right. What is that? What, what is that? What is that? Fuck off, will you? Fuck off. <laughs> OK? <laughs> you <laughs> fucking pieces of shit. Raw! 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 Shit! Fucking shit! <laughs> Fire, two salmon, one tackle telly. No, Chef, don't say that, please. <laughs> oh my God, it, it's so much worse than it actually is when you listen to it, and then the animation makes it seem even worse than that. That's like the best thing about the internet. Is that shit? There's this third one where he becomes the sun. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, you've gone back to the beginning. You fucking muppet. Has Gordon Ramsay ever called someone a muppet, or is that just my imagination? Yeah, I believe he does. Yes, chef. <laughs> you are the fucking most useless human being I've ever seen. You are subhuman. Yes, chef. And they just agree with it. Most of the time, they're just like, Yes, chef. I want this job, chef. It's not like they don't watch the show. It's not like when they sign up for this thing, they don't know what Gordon Ramsay does. They probably have to sign a contract. Gordon Ramsay dishes out lots of abuse. This is for dramatization for the TV. Do you like this? Yes or no? All responses will be yes, chef, or no, chef. Vinny, the Muppets did a thing with Gordon. Do me a favor. Off outside, get a big deep breath of fresh air. Piss off. Okay. Go on, outside. Outside. Hey, look at me. F off. What a f Muppet. It's Muppet. Wow, he did it. Go outside, take a piss. What, chef, you want me to take a. I what? Did you question? Sorry. <laughs> I can't do the voice. Every time I get loud, like my lungs are like, nope, you're not gonna do it. Go to the bathroom, take a shit now. You! You! Me? Yes! Yes, Chef. I want you to complete Halo on Legendary Difficulty. Sir, I've never played a video game before. Oh, here's Nintendo's hand boss again. So, Milky Way wishes. I'm gonna go back here and look for that thing I missed. So, I'm gonna need your help, chat. Where is this last power that I missed? Is it in autumn? Go all the way left during winter? Man, I, um, I think people said I wasn't disappointed enough. Ooh. Ow. My helper got the fucking- God damn it, helper! I just want the world to revolve around me, Chad. Is that such a- Is that such a big deal? You know? God, bird ability is so good. Even though birds aren't real. God, bird is so good! Except for when you need to- do this down here. That's, that's not quite happening, is it? Oh. oh! I love this boss. I remember this now. This is so great. I will grant you one wish. Well, I want to control Popstar. No marks. No. So now Popstar is mine. All mine. Fuck off, marks. Now I can cause all the mischief I want. Smell you later. Ho 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 fucking marks. I don't know if hammer's gonna be the suplex city. <laughs> I, I, nope, suplex is not a good skill for- alright, 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 chat. Okay, I have every skill. Hammer- yo-yo seems nice. Let's try yo-yo for a little bit. Oh, mirror might be good too, but yo-yo has like a good range to it. Whoa! Oh, god! I thought we were gonna get, like, a second phase. 
the end. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. That cool knights reappeared, defeat foes to store power, then touch the screen to use abilities. Oh, that's cool. I like this mode already. Man, this is... I, I think Superstar Ultra is great. All these little extra game modes, the visuals are nice. The Kirby nostalgia bait is handled very well. Just, you know, in terms of content, you get good nostalgia for the original Kirby. You get, like in this version, you get the arena modes. You get to play as Meta Knight. Great Cave Offensive is a lot of fun, which I'm not going to be completing, sorry. But it is cool, and it's it's there's a lot of games in this that are, you know, pretty sizable. Some are pretty short. The mini games are fun, but I would still say Kirby 64 is a tough one to beat because of the combo skills. Though it does play a little slow, which is why I, I default to like Robobot or Nightmare in Dreamland, because that's 3D Kirby handled in a way that I think elevates it. Like, it's just a lot of fun to play those games with some really great powers, but I would love the combos again. If Kirby 64 was a little faster, that would be cool. But yeah, next Kirby game would be great with double combos again, and uh, yet the style of, like, say, you know, the, the newest Kirby game, uh, Star Allies. Triple combos? Oh my god, make your own moves. That's what's next for Kirby, it's just, you can make your own moves. Like, make them as stupid as you want, we don't care. One day I'll check out Star Ride. Kirby Superstar was Sakurai's last main Kirby game, so it makes sense he would put so much into it. Uh, Air Ride, not Star Ride, what the fuck? I was thinking Star Allies. I mean, this is one of the best games on the Super Nintendo. I feel like this is when Kirby really became... Like, Kirby was cute and good, make no mistake. Like I said, I played Dreamland a lot, and I played, um, Kirby's Adventure. Like, I rented that one a lot. I think this elevated Kirby into, like, the pantheon of... You know, like, this is some good shit. Have you ever played Squeak Squad? No. I played Amazing Mirror. I didn't play Squeak Squad. There's a lot of Kirby games, and, um, I know there's, like, people that are, like, way bigger Kirby fans than me who have played every game. That is not I. I just love the series, but I haven't played everything. Epic Yarn I haven't played. Epic Yawn. Yeah, I've heard... It gets a little boring. It's very babby, babby easy. And for a Kirby game, babby easy, you don't want to hear that because they are already kind of, you know, on the easy side. Except for the extra stuff and the final bosses and stuff like that. Some of the final levels in Kirby games can get kind of challenging, but... Okay, well then, chat, let me ask you a question. What's the worst Kirby game? Because I don't think there's really, like, a bad game in the series. There's no misfires. But which one would you say is the least good? Dreamland 3, Kirby 1, Avalanche? What the fuck is Kirby's Avalanche? Is that where you draw on the screen? That- that was like a DS game? Shitty Puyo Puyo? Oh, that was the- the Puyo clone! Right, okay. Okay, well- well, hang on a minute. What was the one where you draw- what was Mass Attack? Rainbow Curse? Was that a thing? There was a spin-off that was like that Yagi game? Also, Dreamland 3 is not that bad. I didn't- I never finished it, but I- I didn't have much of a problem with it. Canvas Curse is the one where you draw, and which one's Mass Attack, where you have a fuckload of Kirbys, and- Do you use the stylus for that, or- There's a lot of fucking spin-offs in the series, too. Mass Attack had good mini-games. Vinny, this mo game mode has no exploration, you just gotta go fast. A little cheesy, no? That's <laughs> a little cheesy. Wait a minute. That was only one level? You go through every Kirby mode? This whole mode is like an hour long? Are you serious? Do I have to go through... Do I have to go through Cave Offensive? Oh, no. Yes, but no collecting. Speedrun it is.
might have been a waste. Wow, couldn't hit the screen quick enough. I love these cutscenes. Such a nice addition. And hey, at least you got to see more of Great Cave Offensive, considering I didn't finish it. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Meta Knight is going to his own ship, the Halberd, to fight it? Who is in command of the Halberd? I guess I'll find out. Don't tickle me, Elmo. Um, 24 people an hour molested in Times Square. Plus, subways dirtier than ever. The city that never sweeps. So there you go. Oh, I've shown this on stream? Oh, okay, sorry. Bad memory. It might be a little harsh. It might be more like they put their hand on your shoulder to bother you to take a picture with them. That said, fuck those people. Fuck the people with the bootleg Spider-Man costumes, which are not licensed by Marvel. It's just some dude putting on a Spider-Man costume and, and trying to make money off of you taking a photo with them. That's why when people say, Vinny, should I check out Times Square? I say, yes, check it out for about 10 minutes. Get on the train, get over there, and then get right the fuck back on the train after 10 minutes, and then leave. Do, do not buy anything. Just look at it, feel the energy of it, and then don't bother, because there's not really much... There's really not much that you're gonna do there that's gonna be worth it. Yeah, New York City has its own thing. I love it. Boston has a good vibe, though. I like Boston's vibe. I've only ever been in Boston in the winter, though, or like the beginning of spring, so it's always been too cold to fully appreciate, but Boston's great. Vin, what are you doing? I don't know. Yep, that was a waste. Hopefully I, I think, yeah. This is, this is me finishing the game, aside from like the true arena, which maybe I could do. True arena's good. Well, how, how long do you think it would take me to beat True Arena? Because I'd have to, like, come back to this game another time to do it. Like an hour? It's pretty tough. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What happened? Did, did I mute? I think I muted by accident. When I went to use my other power, I pressed minus, which is my mute button. I was wondering, why was no one... I, I said, um... Hey, wait, I got a new complaint. Forever in debt for your priceless advice. I was talking that, like, pretty much, not the whole... Yeah, pretty much the whole time. Shit. Vinny, I thought you were being a gamer. No. God damn it. Like, I know the show gets better and better. Someone said, but episode three is the best movie. Sure it is. I just wish I could wish my feelings away. No, it's because I'm so in love with you. Sure it is. It's, oh, that was two. All right, well, the third one was the other one. Um, hey, listen, Palpatine's great in it. It's a fun movie, a lot of good memes. It's the best of the three, it, you know, but oh man, oh man. It's just got prequelitis written all over it. And I don't buy- I said this when I watched the movie, I'm sorry to say this. I know a lot of you grew up with the prequels and you love them dearly, and that's fine. Anakin's fall to the dark side is such bullshit. It's so quick. I will do what you say, my master! But the Chancellor is a Sith Lord to killing kids in under 15 minutes. Everyone's, like, a stupid dummy who's clouded by the dark side of the Force because that's what the plot needs them to be. Come on. Don't get me wrong, even the original series is not an overly intelligent, you know, set of movies at times. It's dumb, it's fun, it's Star Wars, right? We know that, but... So, that's why I'm looking forward to seeing what Filoni's gonna do with, um... with Episode 3 in Clone Wars Season 7, yes? Because I'll be honest, what I've seen of Clone Wars is already better than any of the prequel stuff. It makes the prequel so much more likable. It's six, technically. Oh, right, right. Tec there's a technicality because of the Gen Gendi, Gendi Tartakovsky. How do you say that man's name? 
Every time Palpatine and Anakin were, like, hanging out together, Palpatine would, like, fucking trick him into hating the Council. Yeah. Yes. Yes, but Anakin's this great noble hero that then kills kids. And that's before Amidala even di Well, whatever. Whatever, man. There's whole arcs dedicated to Anakin hating the Council. Yep. Well, thank- thank God for Filoni, because Lucas sure as fuck didn't have it. Again, watching it after years of not having seen that movie, with the idea like, oh no, episode three was good. It, it is, at times. But then Obi-Wan rides a dinosaur. It, it goes from riding a dinosaur, to, uh, you know, killing younglings, to, no, to do it. It's just, it's, it's a very silly movie, and the memes are fantastic. Very silly. But them Clone Wars already, like I said, much more, uh, I like them a lot. I like them Clone Wars a lot. It makes the whole thing a lot more likable. <laughs> Luke, did I ever tell you about Ahsoka Tano? Nope. Luke, did I ever tell you that... Did I ever tell you that I knew R2? He was my droid. Hello, little one. Who are you? No, no, no. That was my droid in the Clone Wars, Luke. Like, I flew with R2 and... This is the weakest part of this game. I, I really don't like this lava stuff. I mean, granted, I'm not paying full attention, but I've already played all this. So, I'm happy to just talk shit, to be honest, because I'm, I'm a little bored. I, I like this game mode just because Meta Knight is awesome, but... And that was a really rewarding fight to finish. Amazing. Okay, it is now a quarter to four, so this is going kind of late. And apparently I have a difficult boss up ahead, so that's gonna be fun. Why is it that the end of... Kirby... ...streams always end up going like an extra 20 minutes to a half hour late? This like almost always fucking happens. Oh boy. This is the first game to have Galactic Knight, or Galacta Knight. I didn't know this was a debut role. Yep, dude hits hard. Let's just summon those wacky minions so I can get a heal. Oh, uh, fuck! <sighs> Vinny, you have a heal now. I had a heal? <sighs> didn't see that. Every time I looked down, it was grayed out, and I couldn't look for long. Let's hope there's no phase two. Alright. <laughs> so close for the first try. It would have been first try if I fucking healed. But that was cool. Okay, took an hour. I watched the rest of that video last night, where Gordon was served steak that had Pam sprayed directly onto it. And there was another steak that was just plain raw that he got. It was like... You know, he made his jokes about, Oh God, it's gonna jump off the fucking plate! But it was genuinely disgusting. And like, you see people that have like steaks frozen for like three weeks. And, like, they're just unfreezing them. Like, you would think, if you're gonna do a show that's gonna be on national TV with Gordon Ramsay attending, you would, like, buy some fresh meat. But I guess it's... kind of better to be honest about it. Because these restaurants are failing miserably. And they need help. I, I love it when, um, when he goes to help a restaurant, and they argue with him. And they tell him he's wrong and he's shit. It's like, dude, no, no, this is... This is not the time to be arguing with people that are going to help you. Your restaurant is making no money because you have a fucking walk-in freezer that has become sentient, and it looks like dead space. It's like, uh, Kirby's arena modes are always really good. I was gonna say Karina. Kerbrina modes. Yeah, face the wrong way! <laughs> Look, it's American Kirby. I, I can't cheese this boss, can I? Please. Uh, long ways to go yet. <sighs> 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 <sighs>
didn't go so great. Wait, why is it picking up from here? Oh, it, it's just a random order? Oh, that makes a lot more sense. Oh, no. Chat, why can't I get a helper? Is there a way to get helper and then have the, the hammer come back? Remember to heal between rounds. The problem with that is then these are limited um, apples or tomatoes. Cabula always delete helper. That sucks. Dro drop hammer, pick up helper, make fighter your helper, then retrieve hammer. That was Japes. Good helper. Eh. Fucking... Ugh. The bombs are not good for this fight. Almost no healing items left. This music is great. Oh! Yeah, Poppy. Good shit. The last four. Fuck. Electrocuted. And goodbye, power! Try again. Wrong way, dude! Wrong way twice! I was blocking, but I guess that was too much. Fuck. Oh god, oh god, stop, DDD, stop. Oh, God. I got greedy. I got real greedy. Haha. <laughs> Alright, getting better at this. And now my two favorite enemies. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yes. Good. This fight is not good for me. Unbelievable. Nice job, Kermit. Thank you! Uh, it was better. Still not great, but better. Who's the cunt that told me to do that in chat? How do you even do this fight now? I mean, I'm fucking dead anyway, but... It's really good if you're in Milky Way Wishes. Well, yeah, you can't lose your powers in Milky Way Wishes. <sighs> he stops when he comes close. Should have thrown the hammer. You're right! Long ways to go yet! Okay. I can do this with hammer. I know I can. And if I could just, like, do the thing that the chat member suggested and spin through the attack- Ah! It'll be fine. Should not be taking any damage on this boss fight. What a silly ultimate god. I don't know any of these patterns. Okay! That's what that is? Vinny, throw the hammer. I'll try, like, one or two more times, but then I'm gonna get going, because I wanna eat. I mean, at least we got to see the boss, but I don't know if I have the skill or time for this. <sighs> Fuck that. Alright, so... Galactonite. I now forgot how to fight. Galactonite is tough. Okay, one more time. One- I can do this one more time, chat. That's- that's all I got left. Just sitting back in my seat now. Which isn't really doing me any favors, I've noticed. It's everything. It's harder to see with my old eyes. My eyes are wrinkly. As my brain is smooth. I just stopped- I kinda stopped caring, didn't I? Too close to the hand. Fuck. 
I have a stank face on right now. You can't see it, but it's very stanky. Where's them bloopers? Uh, is that supposed to be a laugh track? Here, because I can get one. There's a crusty-ass laugh track noise. Cough at the end, that's good. <laughs> Alright, well that was cool. Alright, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm good. I'm good on this game. I'm sorry, I can't, I can't beat this game. I just can't beat this game. Eventually I probably could, but at the moment I cannot beat this game, so... I don't know if I'll return to it, but it was, it was cool. I just kind of gave up because I, uh, I got impatient. But it was fun.